Okay, so today for our bar workout, let's go ahead and start with the weights. Using twos, um, I'm using fives, I've worked up to that. So start. let's just start with our feet about hip width apart, take an inhale. Exhale, chin to the chest, just a little roll down. Let the head and neck relax. Let those weights pull you all the way down to the floor. Feel the back of the legs stretching. Now bend the knees, draw the belly in and start to roll up, keeping that chin into the chest and press those weights up to the ceiling. Inhale, exhale, chin to the chest, rolling down. And bend the knees, draw the belly in, start to roll up, really feeling a stretch in between those shoulder blades as you roll up. Last time, chin into the chest, rolling down. And bending the knees, draw the belly in, rolling up all the way through the spine, pressing up from here. Let's we'll start down into our squats. So squatting down and press, nice and slow to start. Two and press, three and press, four, press, five. Getting nice and deep every time, and seven, and eight. Good, stay down, arms wide, little pulses with the legs, up and down, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Again, full motion, down, press, two, press, three, press, four, Press five, six, seven, eight. Good. Now slide down into that squat and just the arms pulse up and down. One, two, three, four. Draw that belly in. Five, six, seven, eight. Full motion down. Press up. Two and up. Getting deeper every time. Three. Four, sinking back into your heels, lift up your toes. Five, six, seven, and eight. Good, staying down here, holding. Let's do the arms and legs together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more, and eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one. Now press all the way up and come to a releve. So lift those heels up, drop the heels down, come down in your squat. All the way up, releve. Drop the heels, squat. And releve. And drop. Lift those heels up. And drop. Lift those heels up. Drop and up, and down, up, down, up, down. Last time, up, down. Now come all the way up, bring those arms out. Just lift those heels up, down, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, keep going. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold it up one. Open those arms, stay on releve, squeeze your rear, and little pulses up and down with the arms. One, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, seven. Six, four, three, two, one. Drop the arms down, come down into your squat. Draw that belly in, shoulders back and down, little pulses here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. One, now from here, you're gonna go down. You're gonna go all the way up and take the arms out to the side and lift one leg up, back down. 
two and down three and four complete control five and six and seven and eight keep going let's do eight more eight seven six five four three two one stay here touch the toes arms down lift two and a three four five six seven eight good stay up pulse one two three four five six seven eight feet back to parallel roll those shoulders inhale exhale good now squat down staying here little pulses one two three four five six seven eight and eight seven six five four three two one this time i just want you to take your arms palms facing each other straight up above your head and straight down two and down sinking into the heels three and down four down five down six down seven down eight let's do eight more and eight my core is lifted and working and six and five and four and three and two and a one stay here holding it here let's do eight pulses eight seven six five four three two one holding it here just those arms up down two down three hold on to that core four drop those shoulders five and six and seven and eight sink lower in the legs if you can keep going eight and seven and six and five four almost there three two and one and come all the way up inhale exhale we're gonna go to the other side with the leg lifts taking those arms out to the side so take another inhale your heart rate should be high all right sinking down let's do eight pulses here to start eight seven six five four three two one other leg down lift two lift three four five six seven eight eight more eight seven six five sink nice and low in that squat three two one stay up down lift two three four five six seven eight keep those arms out pulse one two three four five six seven eight drop down Woo. roll those shoulders those fives get heavy fast and roll 
Good, reach forward, stretch out the backs of those legs. Good, all right, let's place the weights down for a moment and grab your band. Here you are, we have our band. We're gonna take it wide, second position, okay? So this is wider than your hips, obviously, so you can get nice and low. So let's sink down, take your elbows, press them against your knees, and feel that nice stretch right in your hip sockets, helping you to get lower and deeper into the exercise every time that you come to this position. Good, and coming all the way up. So holding your strap right in front of your chest, shoulders down and back, thinking of engaging underneath the armpit, right in back of your shoulder blade. And let's go right back down into that round plie, pull that strap and lift. Two, and a lift. Three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, keep going, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now pulses, arms and legs, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, stay here, okay? There's tension on the strap, so my arms are not relaxed. We're gonna rotate to one side, center, other side, rotate, rotate, deepen in those legs, rotate. Try not to move the hips, just the shoulders. Rotate, and rotate. We're really feeling the obliques here. Gives you a nice twist in your spine. And twist, and twist, and twist, and twist. Now stay over to one side, hold it here. Pulse those arms, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Twist, other side. Pulse with those arms, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, back center, and come all the way up, lower those arms, roll the shoulders. Good work. Inhales, exhales, take those arms up high, okay? Important here not to let those shoulders creep up to your ears, drop those shoulders down, and make sure the strap is not directly above your head, but more right in front of your, uh, more diagonal, to your forehead, okay? So if I glance up without moving my head, I can see the strap, okay? And pulling, one, and lift, two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, eight, keep going, and eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, one. Now those pulses. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold it here. Now I'm going to lift the arms a little higher. There's still tension on my strap. I want you to tilt to the side. Feel the oblique kick in, center, other side, and center, side, center. Go slowly so you really feel those muscles working. Side, center, side deep and into that grand plie. Those legs are still working. Side, try not to rotate in this, just directly to the side. And side, side, and side, center. 
Drop those arms, keep those legs where they are. Take your hands to your hips, pulse those legs. One, two, they're shaking. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Come all the way up, inhale. Exhale, one more with the strap in grand plie. Now take the strap behind the back, okay? And I want you to get quite a bit of tension on it. And I want you to keep your elbows close and your palms facing each other, okay? So your elbows are close to your rib cage. Back to that second position. Make sure you have enough tension. All we're gonna do is we're gonna slide those arms forward and bring it in, okay? Forward and in, forward and in, forward. Try not to let the shoulders cave forward, keep them back. Abs are in, seven and eight, good. Keep going and eight and seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, good, now stay down, hold those arms, elbows in front of that rib cage, little pulses with the legs, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, hold still. You're gonna lift the heels up, push those arms forward, bring it in, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, back to pulses with the legs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Push forward. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now keep those heels lifted, bring those elbows in. Pulse here. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now drop the heels, push those arms forward. Lift, two, lift, three, Ooh, four, five, six, seven, eight. Keep those heels lifted again. Last set of pulses, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hold, deep and lower. Feel the shakes and the quakes in those legs. They're getting tired. Working them to fatigue. That's okay. Seven, eight, drop and rest. That's a really good one for balance. I even lost mine. <laughs> Go ahead and reach forward. Stretch out the backs of those legs. Bending one knee, straightening one. And switch. And switch again. Good. Back to the center. Grab the backs of your legs if you can and just draw your body towards your legs. Feel that stretch release. Bending those knees, rolling up through the spine. Okay, setting your strap to the side. Don't set it too far away. We're going to grab it again. Grab those weights again, okay? We're gonna go to our lunge series, and today we're gonna do this with bicep curls, okay? So right leg forward, left leg back in a nice deep lunge, palms forward. Again, it's important anytime you're doing bicep curl, we're not rounding the shoulders to bring the weight up to the bicep. We're keeping the shoulders out, we're keeping those elbows right at the rib cage, and we're drawing the arm up and then back down, okay? No momentum, palms up, and lunge down, draw those arms up, and down, two, and down, three, and four, and five, six, seven, and eight. Let's do eight more, and eight, and seven, and six, Four, three, two, one. Stay here. Now open the arms so they're right in front of you and pulse just the legs. One, two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold the legs still, pulse the, pulse the arms, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. Come up. Release those arms. Let's do eight. Lunge down one. And two. And three. And four. And five. Six. Seven. And eight. Hold it here. Release those arms. Shift your body weight forward so the back leg is straight. Front leg is bent. Bring those arms forward and in. Bend that back knee. Push forward. Bend the back knee. Three. In. Four. In. Good. It looks like this from the side. Five. In. Six. In. Seven. In. Eight. Keep going. Eight. Seven. You're not going up and down, just forward and back. And five, four, three, two, one. Good. Bring it in. Now shift your body weight forward. Bring that leg in. And we're going to shift off the floor out. Bring the knee in. Two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, keep going, eight more, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold it here, one, hold, hold, bending that standing leg even more, stretching that back leg out, six, seven, eight, bring the feet together. Good work. Stretch it forward. Stretch out that leg. A few deep breaths. Good. And rolling up. Let's go to the other side. All right. So this is all about stability and control. Left leg forward. Right leg behind, palms forward. Roll those shoulders, abdominals nice and tight. And bicep and lunge. And two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Keep going. Eight more. And eight. And seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one. Stay here. Open those arms. Just the legs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold the legs still. Just those arms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Come all the way up. Lengthen those arms out. Inhale. Exhale. Let's go down for eight. And one. And uh, two, try and get deeper in that lunge. Three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. Down in that lunge, arms forward. Here I am to the side in my lunge, shifting forward in two, in three, in four and 
five, six, seven, eight, keep going, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, good, shifting the body forward, bringing those knees together, or oh, standing like a shake in hand, out, and a two, three, four, you can slide the foot on the floor if you need to, six, seven, eight, good, now holding it out there, hold, two, three, deep in, four, five, six, seven, eight, and legs together. Woo, all right, slide that down, stretch it out. And take your arms behind your back, stretch up. Good, release that down. Bend those knees, start to roll it up through the spine. Good, all right. Let's go ahead and grab your bar surface, okay? So I'm gonna move some things around. Grab your chair. Again, couch, back of your bed, kitchen counter. Bring it around and I'm gonna bring it about here. Okay, so facing it, both hands facing your chair. Feet parallel, okay, we're gonna work some outer thigh. So, standing so that your arms are straight, bend those knees, and bring the body weight forward. Abdominals are lifted, my shoulders are down. Okay, I'm just placing my hands on the chair. Take the right leg out to the side, okay? Without shifting in the body, I want you to lift it up and down. Two, and three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Keep going. And eight. My core is really working here, especially my oblique, keeping my body square. And five, six, seven, eight. Now I want you to pulse it up. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold it here. Bring the knee in and out. Two, out. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hold it here. A little bit different. You're going to pulse up and down. Pulse, but you're going to shift it behind you. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Hold it in arabesque. Pulse here for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now pulse again and shift. Two, three. Back to the side. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Pulse here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, again, and shift to arabesque, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, pulse for eight, seven, six, this leg is burning, five, three, two, one, shift, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, feet together, and lift up, excellent work. Cross that standing leg, because that's really the leg that was working. Cross it over and just sit back and stretch that out. Works, very intense work with that. Good. Release that up. Whew. Excellent work. Okay. Shifting now to the other leg. 
I'll pull my chair around here. We can go to the other side. So legs parallel, arms away. If you feel your shoulders creeping up, try and either separate your arms a little bit on your chair or come back a little bit and bring your body more forward to release some tension in the neck and shoulders. Bending those knees, abdominals lifted, other leg out to the side. This one's already feeling sore because it's been worked. Lifting up and down. Two, three, four, five. Remember to keep that standing leg bent the whole time. Seven and eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now we're in a pulse. One, two, three, four, five. Seven, eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now shifting. Pulse. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And back around. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, hold it here. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And second set. Two, three, four. Shift into arabesque. Six, seven, eight here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Back around. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight here. Eight. Six, five, four, three, two, third and last time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Back around. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, I forgot one thing, in and out. Two, I always remember, three and four, you got it, five, woo, six, seven, eight, and together, and come up. Oh Lord, okay, stretch that out. You know, you're not even getting the leg, and we're not even lifting the leg high. Small, tiny movements, but the work is very, very deep. Okay, so you want to make sure to get that stretched. The beauty of doing this kind of work is that you're working the smaller muscles so that you're getting a more chiseled uh, physique and your body is stronger instead of just working the larger muscles, like when we're lifting heavier weights. We're working those tiny little muscles, and that's what actually stabilizes your body. So coming back, just separate your feet, and nice little stretch here. Just let your chest and your neck fall. Take a few deep breaths here. Excellent work. All right, let's actually get rid of our bar surface and we'll come to the floor. Grab your mat if you've got one. And we're going to do a few different things on the floor. We'll work core, of course. That's very important. But we're also going to work some thighs as well as arms. So I want you to grab your strap and one weight, okay? Also, if you don't have weights at home, you can always use water bottles uh, or canned goods for any of this. All right, working into our core muscles. So let's go ahead and grab your strap here, okay? Holding it in front of the chest, sitting up nice and tall. 
for your inhale. Exhale, scoop rock back and draw that strap out. And then release back up, inhale. Exhale again. And release up. And three. And up. And four. And up. And five. And up. And six. And up. And seven. And up. And eight. Good. Now I want you to scoop back in your C curve here. As far back as you can go. The knees can also be bent if you prefer. Okay? And pulse those arms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We'll do eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And scoop round up, sit tall. Inhale, exhale again for eight, back slow. One, and lift, and a two, and lift, and three, and four, and five, six, and seven, and eight, good. A little different this time, I want you to scoop rock back in your C curve and just one arm pulse or pull. One, two, don't let your body shift. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other side, other arm. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, and rest. Lift all the way up. Awesome work. Put that strap to the side for now. Now bending those knees, okay? And I want you to place your arms right on top of the other, of each other here. And sitting up tall, inhale, exhale, scoop round here, okay? From here, stay in your C scoop. I want you to take one knee. And if you can, hit your arms and down. Other knee, up and down. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's harder than it looks. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, rest, lift all the way up. Good, stretch. Now you can stay with the single leg or you can join me for a double leg tap, okay? So arms here, inhale, exhale, scoop around. Here we go. If you can, bring your knees to your arms and down. Two and down. Three. Four, five, six, seven, and eight, and down, and lift up. Good work. All right, moving a little more into the obliques, we're going to do a twist, okay? So again, holding your arms in that position, one on top of the other, scoop back to your C curve. You can keep your feet on the mat. And rotate one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Center and rolling up. Inhale. Just take the legs out in front of you. Let's do a quick stretch. Reach up and all the way forward. Good. rolling up through the spine and let's go back we're going to do rotation again you can take your feet off the floor or keep them on 
So hands here, scoop around, taking the feet off if you'd like, and rotate. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Center, feet down and roll the spine up. Good. Let's take it all the way down to the mat. Lying down. Good. Now, take both knees into your chest here. Okay, hug those knees in. Give it a little rock side to side. Good. Now, placing both hands on your outer calf, okay? Knees together, inhale, exhale, scoop, chin into the chest, rolling into a nice tight ball, okay? We're gonna do a single leg stretch here. You're gonna take your left leg and your left arm out, bring it together. Let's do the other side. Out, same arm as leg, and together. Now both legs together and arms out, and in. Exhale, and in. Two, and in, both arms and legs, and in. Three, three, and out, and in. Four, other side, and both legs, and five, and both arms and legs, and In seven and out last time eight and out and in and lower down inhale exhale good take the legs tabletop position now arms down by your sides okay we're gonna inhale, exhale. You can keep the head and neck down if your neck is bothering you. If not, inhale, exhale, scoop around forward here. Reaching your fingertips past your body. You're gonna lower one foot down, touch, and lift, other leg. Two, and lift, three, four, five. Seven, eight, keep going in, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, stay here. You're going to lower both feet down and lift all the way up, two, and lift. Three and lift. Four and lift. Five and lift. Six and lift. Seven and lift. And eight. Lift and lower down. Hug those knees into the chest. Inhale. Exhale. Good, back to that tabletop position. Squeeze those knees together. Inhale, exhale, scoot forward if you'd like or leave the head down on the mat. We're gonna do that same thing, except we're gonna lift our arms to the ceiling as our legs go down. Both legs down, arms go up and down. Two and a down. Three, four, Make sure your back is not arching, staying in neutral. Six, seven, and eight. Keep going. Eight, seven, six, five, and four. And three, and 
two and one and rest good hug those knees into the chest rocking side to side good work all right grabbing your strap as we're lying down I want you to grab it and I want you to place your feet up in your strap just like this okay and your feet are um, a little bit closer than uh, so they're not touching each other but they're but they're not hip width apart they're a little closer than that cross your strap okay pull your elbows down into the mat and already feel your abdominals kick in okay make sure you're in a nice neutral spine that your back is not curled under okay make sure you're nice neutral spine I'm just gonna press the legs apart and together two together three now as those legs are going apart feel those abdominals engage five six seven eight let's do the eight pulses eight seven six five four three two one back to slow push and release two release three and four five six seven eight now little pulses eight seven six five four three two one last set release two release three and four five six seven eight now little tiny ones one two three four five six seven eight oh good work release those legs ah good hug them into the chest let's go ahead and put one ankle over the knee a little stretch here draw the legs forward and release other side over to one side I want you to prop yourself up on your elbow here okay we're gonna do a little side work and you have the option to keep the knees bent okay where we're up here or if you'd like you can straighten the legs all the way long just make sure they're slightly in front of your body okay so lifting up knees straight or bent and you're just gonna lower the hips down lift two lift three four five six seven and eight stay here lift the top arm up straight up to the ceiling and thread the needle you're going to take the arm down through underneath your armpit and then back up to the ceiling two back up to the ceiling three four five six seven and eight hold it here hold four five six seven eight bend the knees release down good work let's go to the other side swing your body around again knees can be bent for the whole exercise or straighten those legs make sure that your elbows right underneath your shoulders and lifting up holding here lower down lift two lift 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hold it here, lift that top arm up and thread the needle through and lift. And four and five and six and seven and eight. Holding it here, hold one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and lowering down. Excellent work, good, good work for the side. Okay, coming up onto your knees, okay? So you're, I'm, I'm just up here on my knees and my knees are just about right underneath my hips, okay? I'm gonna work into a little bit of quad and hamstring work just to finish, okay? Now I'm gonna turn to the side so that you can see my profile as I do this. Now, if this is too much, for your knees, you don't even have to do this exercise, okay? Because this can be a little bit intense on the knees if you have knee problems. But all you're gonna do is you're going to just sit back and let your rear hover over your feet. Don't let it touch and lift up, okay? So that's the motion with the legs. Go ahead and grab your weight, just one of them, in your hands. So you're gonna go down, let the rear hover and push the weight up. Two, push, three, push, four, push, five, push, six, and seven, and eight. Good, you're gonna stay down as low as you can here, and that weight goes forward and in. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. Push it up and down. Two and down. Three and down. Four and down. Five. Seven and eight. Good. Come all the way up. Now, holding that weight, or you can place it down. All I want you to do is keep those hips pressing forward, and I want you to just lean back, hinging back. Hold and come forward. Again, back. Feel those hamstrings, rear and quad, kick in and forward. And back, hold, and forward. You don't even have to go as far back as I'm going. Back, hold, and forward. And back, hold, and forward. And back, hold, and forward. Excellent work. Let that weight go down. Let's go ahead and grab our straps back. Lie down for a quick little stretch. And putting both feet up. And just draw the legs towards you, feeling the hamstring stretching here. release one leg. You can leave this leg bent or straighten and just pull that leg towards you. Feel that hamstring stretch. And switching legs. that knee 
Now roll over to your side, extending the bottom leg, okay? And just take the top leg and just do a little knees together, do a little quad stretch here. So bringing your, holding onto your foot and bringing it to your rear and just press those hips forward. Good, release, and switching to the other side. Lying down, bottom leg stretch, top leg, grab that foot, and press those hips forward as you bring the heel as close as you can to your rear. Good, release that. And pushing yourself up, let's bring the legs in front of you. Flex those feet, arms up, reach forward, reach for your toes, and just let the body fall over your legs. Feel the back stretching. Relax your neck and shoulders. And slowly release that and roll all the way up. All right, if you want to do some extra minutes of stretching, I recommend it. That was pretty intense. And we'll see you guys later.